So what are the issues of using model articles when you're setting up a UK limited company? Well, you'd be quite surprised to know disaster follows by using model articles. And I'll explain why in this video. Hi everyone, my name is Sami Mishevich from Optimized Accountants and in this video I'm going to be sharing with you the disasters that follow if you use model articles for your UK limited company. You may have set them up with a model articles but you might want to change them as a result of this video, especially if you are now a sole director and you might have previously co-directors or shareholders. Whatever it is, you might want to think twice now of using model articles. So go, let's go through the details. You can see the uh, registry link of setting up your own limited company if you're confident and comfortable enough to do that. Uh, but you might already have a limited company in the UK. I have created a video to help you set up a UK limited company should you wish to do so. So the link will be above me and in the video description box below. There's also a corporation tax calculator, which we have created to help you understand what your tax liabilities will be owning a UK company. Again, this is on our website. There is a video to show you how to use it best. So people setting up a company may have done so by mitigating risk or saving tax, whatever that might be for the reasons that's absolutely fine. Not a problem. What I would suggest when you're watching this video and you're a little bit nervous about what's been suggested or talked about, then book a tax consultation with us at Optimize Accountants using the code YouTube25 to get your 25% discount. So I did a previous video, but I want to take the mistake number five that I talked about in that previous video about the mistakes using an image company in this. So you'll see mistake number five. That's because I really want to focus on it in this shorter video. And this is all about sole directors and having legal rights over other people and discussing their model articles. What are their legal rights of removing other directors and shareholders? So the case that you need to look at is this Hashmi versus Lorimer. So in March 2021, the founder and developer had fallen out. This is IT developer, not property developer. Founder wrote to developer on 2nd of March 2021 to inform him that he'd been removed as a director and was deemed a bad lever under the definition bad lever in the company articles, meaning he had forfeited his shares. So this guy was a shareholder and now has just been written to to say you no longer own these shares. Interesting. The third director subsequently resigned and ceased to be a director. So they've seen this falling out and decide, hey, I don't want part of this. Now I'm leaving as well in June. So from that date, the founder was back to being a sole director of the company. Pretty happy with the conclusion, I would have thought. However, on August 2021, the developer, the person who had the shares and directorship taken away presented an unfair prejudice petition to the court seeking unfair uh, seeking an order that found a purchaser his shares in the company on september 2021 the company served a defense a counterclaim asserting various claims against the developer including claims of breach of director's duties breach of contra contract and pre-contractual misrepresentation so there's a whole scuffle going on all because of using model articles, which you're going to see later on. The court granted the developer's application to strike out the company's counterclaim, therefore agreeing that the founder as sole director of a company did not have the requisite authority under the company articles of association to make their counterclaim. So basically the person that said, hey, Mr. Developer, shareholder two, you no longer are a director shareholder, had no rights according to the courts because of the model articles used. Really interesting. So they reversed that decision. One of the court's findings was that the model articles would require an amendment to permit a single director to run a company, including the deletion of model article 11.2 to remove other directors and shareholders. So a real disaster there. So if you are a limited company owner with a share holder and a sole director, please, please, please review your model articles. We have reviewed all of our clients now 
and amended a good portion of them because we know what disasters could follow. And that's it. So uh, have a review, speak to your accountant, your tax advisor to find out what you need to do now.